Hey crew, at the gym, here to tell you about Thursday's workout. The warm up is very integrated into the workout. So start from A, B, C, and D will be the wad. So let's go over A. You're gonna have 20 second intervals. You're doing two rounds of these three movements, 20 seconds worth of cat cow, 20 seconds of thoracic rotation, 20 seconds of bird dog. I will show you what this looks like in a second. Part B, you're gonna roll into the same thing, 20 seconds on of each movement for two sets. Scapula push-ups, scapula row, and then a king squat. Moving into part C, same thing, 20 seconds in each position. We're gonna be laying on our belly, working on our shoulder rehab, positions T, positions Y, positions I, and W. I'll show you what that looks like. Moving on to D, which would be the wad. We are going to do every minute on the minute, so minute stations for 20 minutes. So it's gonna be five rounds because we have four uh, movements. We're gonna do five tempo push-ups, slow motion push-ups, three seconds down, no pause, three seconds up, no pause, five reps total. Rest the remainder of that minute. The next minute, you're doing a 40 second overhead carry with your dumbbell or you could use, or you could do a handstand hold for 20 to 30 seconds, depending on your skill level. Against the wall, or you could do a handstand on, like your feet on a box or your couch and do a pike position hold. Next minute, 15 to 20 glute bridges. You can put your weight on your hips and do it that way. Or if you don't have weight, you could do single leg. And then your next minute is a 40 second bear crawl. However, you're gonna have your hips low and you're trying not to let your butt wiggle. All right, let's start back at A and I'll show you what all these look like. So cat cow, you're on your hands and knees. Look up, arch your back, tuck in, ground your spine. Thoracic rotation, hand on your lower back. Rotate down, rotate up. On the next beat, you're gonna do the other side. That's 20 seconds per side. Next is a cat, uh, bird dog hold. Opposite arm and leg. 20 seconds on one side. 20 seconds on the other side. You're doing that for two rounds. Then moving on to scapula push-ups. You're in a plank position. Bring your shoulder blades together and apart. If you want it harder, you can do it on your elbows. Then you're gonna do scapular rows, so you're gonna grab your weight. If you have rings at home, you can lay, like hang on your rings. Get in a bent over position. So just squeeze the shoulder blades. And then a king squat. So if you want, you can put your hands behind your head. Squat down. Good morning, back to your squat, stand, squat, good morning, squat, stand. Warm up the hammies and the hips. Two rounds of that. Then positions T, Y, I, and W, but you're laying on your belly. Thumbs are going to be pointing up to the ceiling. You're just going to pulse. And then Y, I, and then W, try not to lift your chest too much. Put your hands in your pockets and back up. So as many as you can in the 20 seconds, but not for speed, for quality. Okay, moving on to our workout. Three second count down and up for your push-ups. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, one, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand. That was one, and you're doing five. The next minute is overhead carry. So you're gonna grab your, if you have one dumbbell or kettlebell, hold 20 seconds on one side, 20 seconds the other, and just walk around your house. And then switch sides. If you have one big heavy one or a barbell, 
You could just hold it with both hands, but you're focused on keeping your rib cage in the whole time. Or you could do a handstand hold instead. Glute bridges, you're gonna lay on your back. Okay, you need your weight. If you have it, place it on your hips. Squeeze your butt. And push through your mid foot. Through your mid foot. And then for your bear crawl, you're going to get your hands and knees. Just lift your knees up slightly and you're gonna slowly crawl around your house without letting your butt wiggle. Imagine you have a very hot cup of tea on a saucer sitting on your back and you don't want it to spill or fall off or you give a ball on your back. You don't want it to fall off. See if you can move your knee and your hand at the same time. So your opposite knee and hand at the same time. And if you don't have much space, then try to go forwards, try to go backwards. Just move around for 40 seconds. Those are your four movements. You have a minute at each station, and then you're doing it for five rounds. All right, class is at 7 a.m., 8 a.m., noon, 5, and 6 p.m. Have fun.